1931, the young Austrian logician Kurt Gödel published a paper which contained the proofs of what became known as Gödel's incompleteness theorems. So Gödel's incompleteness theorems certainly revolutionized the field of mathematical logic. Uh, so they're certainly interesting just in that sense. But what's also fascinating about Gödel's incompleteness theorems is, like Heisenberg's uncertainty principle, Einstein's theory of relativity, they've really had a wider intellectual influence, and they've all been interpreted as perhaps placing some limits on scientific rationality. In particular, Gödel's incompleteness theorems have, ha, have been interpreted as having implications in fields like epistemology, philosophy of mind, cognitive science, the possibility of artificial intelligence. So we'll discuss Gödel's, the implications of Gödel's in, incompleteness theorems in those fields, but the starting point for the course will really be understanding what do Gödel's incompleteness theorems say, and how did Gödel go about proving them. So Gödel's first incompleteness theorem, we can paraphrase, as, paraphrase it as saying, in any sufficiently strong formal system, there are arithmetical statements which are true but unprovable. And so to really understand what that's saying, we'll have to talk about what is a formal system, what are proofs in that formal system. And that will really lead us into the historical context for Gödel's results, the study of formal systems by figures in philosophy such as Gottlob Frege, Bertrand Russell, the mathematician David Hilbert, all of whom were seeking to find a formal axiomatic foundation for all of mathematics. And Gödel's result really showed how those projects were, were problematic and maybe fundamentally flawed. So consider the statement, this sentence is false, what's commonly known as the liar's paradox. What we'll see is that Gödel's proof of incompleteness really proceeds by producing a syntactical version of the liar's paradox. What Gödel does is he produces an arithmetical statement which says, I am not provable. 